This is a follow-on guide from my previous video, How Does the Breach Protocol and Hacking Work in Cyberpunk 2077? Now, there was a couple of mistakes I made in that video. The key thing there was how I uh, stated that the buffer length was essentially something that you were going to get from attributes and perks, especially when it comes to intelligence and the breach protocol perks. Now, that's incorrect. There's only one key factor that, in, that can has any impact on the buffer length, and that is in your cyberware, and more specifically, your operating system. So if I hover over my operating system at the moment, you can see that I have an epic operating system and a buffer length of seven. That, if I'm correct, is the only factor towards your buffer size. There is no other factors towards it. So that's the key thing that I wanted to address in this video, which was incorrect in my previous video. There was all this was also going to expand further on how to improve your hacking ability now i did also allude to last time that you needed the perks and attributes again in intelligence and the um, breach protocol that again wasn't exclusively correct what you can do to improve your hacking ability is also get necessary uh, cyberware enhancements to do this as well and i can illustrate that with the, um, the circulatory system enhancement i've got here which increases the breach time of your protocol by 100 percent which is essentially just doubling the time i'll have to uh, to sort of like use the breach protocol which is great if you've got those constantly mutating um uh, breaches um, all I'm going to do now is just illustrate the um, the impact that both the uh, increased breach time and operating system improvement has on a, an essential breach. And I'm just going to use a very simple camera up here as an example. So if I just pop into breach protocol now, as you can see, now I have a buffer length of 7 and a breach time of 67.5. Now it's also important to note that that wasn't exclusively wrong in the sense of putting attributes and and perks in intelligence and the breach protocol um, would not have an effect on your ability to hack because they do they do have a benefit. Um, so that's also key to note. So let's just have a quick look at this one. It's a very simple one. Five one C D B. So obviously it's no start with five. So uh, fifty five. So let's do fifty five. 1c db so 55 1c db very simple one and that's a very simple hack now obviously you can see it's quite easy for me there with the, the improved buffer i have as well because if i had a reduced buffer i wouldn't be able to do uh, things like merge uh, multiple sequences as easily and that in a nutshell is a couple of ways on how to improve your hacking uh, and breach protocol within Cyberpunk 2077. Now, if you found this useful, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you're interested in any more content I will be releasing. Bye for now.